welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm Mike the Explosive One. Let's get cra- Oh, wait. We got a very special guest. I almost forgot. I thought you forgot about me. Absolutely not. Mr. X is here again. Thank you very much for having me. Let's crack into another one. All right, guys. I got I got a real, real barn burner for you today. Oh, Jesus. Is this going to be a sad one? No, kind of. Oh, God. But no, it's just, it's kind of messed up. All Have right. you ever oh, heard of fetus and fetu? Excuse me? Fetus in Fedu. I don't I like, know what a fetus is. I don't is. like where this is going. Yeah. Okay. So there was a man. Oh, okay. There usually are. He was he was 36 years old. Oh, God. 36-year-old men don't do and anything he, positive. And he started having trouble breathing. Okay. Did so, you say breathe, breathing, not bre- breathing? Bre- not breathing. Breathing. Oh, breathing. Okay. Like he was having trouble okay. getting air. All right. Because okay. this is going to take a dark turn if you no, say breathing. So he uh, he's having trouble breathing. <laughs> So he well, went, a lot of 36-year-old men are having trouble breathing, <laughs> but that's more about so, Dungeons and Dragons than anything. Oh, I, this is going to go. This is going to go a place. This fine, Jonas. So, you go with it. Go so with he, it. he ended up, We're ready. Ended We're up doing a scan, and they thought he had a tumor Okay. in his, in it, like his lumbar cavity area. Or, I know this story. Uh, I think I know where I you're know going. I know this story. Go I think ahead. I've heard something like now, this. Yeah. Yeah. Go so ahead. when they cut him open, the, I'm going to read the quote. The, the he they're referring to is the doctor in the operating room. He just put his hand inside, and he said, there are a lot of bones inside. First one limb came out, then another limb came out, then some part of genitalia, then some part of hair, some limbs, jaws, limbs, hair. Inside Bagat's stomach was a strange half-formed creature that had feet and hands that were very developed. Its fingernails were quite long. At first glance, it may look like he had given birth. Actually, what they had done was remove the mutilated body of his twin brother from his stomach. They discovered one of the world's most bizarre medical conditions, fetus in fetu. It's an extremely rare abnormal abnormality that occurs when a fetus gets trapped inside its twin the trapped fetus can survive as a parasite even past birth forming an umbilical cord like structure that leeches on the twins blood supply until it has grown so large that it starts to harm the host which at what point the doctors normally intervene it took 36 years for that to happen it lived inside him for 36 years uh... As like a parasite, and it, it got so big, it like was pressing on his diaphragm, and he couldn't uh, breathe. Whoa. Uh, um, can't we just have fun conversations? I you told you it was gross. It's pretty, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of intrigued by normally, this, it's interesting. No, it's, there's only 90 documented cases of this, this ever happening, Crazy. and normally makes they sense. both die before birth because they're sharing a placenta, but sometimes okay. they survive. And, it, and it, for 90, for 36 years, this happened, this story is like 10, 15 years old, but it came across it like, yeah, so it's, it, it's a thing, dude. I, to say, I, think I, I think I saw this in Alien 1. But, <laughs> yeah, those little, that's, like, yeah. little things jump out, bust out of your chest. That's okay, right. so were they able to resuscitate the brother? The guy would never die. The guy's alive. Oh, the little boy? <laughs> yeah, the creature. Oh, alive. did they try to let it live? I don't think it was like, I don't think it can sustain life on its own. Okay. I would like to bring it to life. Uh, like, this welcome is, this to the is world. Weird. This is weird. I don't, I don't well, care. I, like, how much brain function does it is have? Is it a homunculus like, at that point? Is it what? A what homunculus? homunculus? Like it's, a, it's, it's, a, it's a, a homunculi, yeah, for sure. Yeah. I don't, I don't know what, what were, that word were, means. Were, were you, well, I, was, I, was, I don't know. I did, he tra- he, homunculi, and I'm, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> how I, much brain function would it have? Well, I'm just wondering. Like, okay, if is it? It's alive in there, right? So, is it? Is it? Does it have some level of of brain function? And that, like, it, like its world is inside this dude, but it knows nothing else, right? Yeah. 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 So, uh, but, the technical definition of homunculus is a very small human or humanoid creature. So it was yeah. a, it was a homunculus living oh, inside him. Okay. It's, it's technically, yes. It's okay. A, okay. Good to think. I, I learned something on the Crazy Town podcast. Today. Yeah. Everyone does. Everyone Dr. does. Mr. Everyone. X. I'm not. Su- I'm not surprised. I, sorry, I didn't want that to come off as I'm surprised. I just, I just wonder what tails it would have a tail. You know, like how was it? I, guess, I thought you said. I wonder what kind of tail it would. Have. <laughs> it might have like, tail. It, like an actual actual tail like how, you meant how tail was it maintaining tail. life all this time was it like like he sucking was, it was leeching off its blood supply to get oxygen it wasn't and breathing and it's like having a giant tapeworm 
Kind of. I mean, it's just sharing blood. <laughs> a homunculate worm. I mean, just you're the dude's. Yeah, like Can I you give it a funeral. It means depends how much do you, you name it. <laughs> do you name that, it? Well, I mean, that's the thing. We can, I mean, how are you going to give it a funeral if you don't name it? Do you take a picture with your arm here, around it before they? Here lies it? my twin brother. Who's they leave kind the of a douche, like, and attached, and then like you hold. Yeah, I don't know, dude. He was kind of a douche. He really, I feel like he really he sucked. He lived off me his whole life. It was kind of a parasite. <laughs> like. There's a lot of things you could say. They might be kind of funny about it. Yeah, I, I don't know. Oh I, I mean, they didn't. This, the article obviously didn't go into detail. I don't think it was self sufficient or probably lived out. No, inside no. The, I assume not. The man womb. So it it's sound- like. So it's like my brother is what I'm hearing. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded like you were just listing off like random body parts, and, and you were like, "Yeah, they removed chicken nuggets and shins and kneecaps, a jaw and, and an arm, yeah, and feathers." Genitals. Yeah. So wait, did the, the you, you kind of the way they wrote it? It sounded like the doctor was surprised. Like w- w- they the, thought it was a tumor. So yeah. like, what what crappy like medical imaging system I were mean, they using? Was, you couldn't I said see this what was this like was. a long time ago. It was like 15, it was at least fifteen 50, years ago. Was not that long ago. Twenty maybe. It was. Not, it was definitely. Ooh. I think the. Think about where you were 20 years ago. That wasn't that long ago, man. Dude, they didn't have smartphones back then. That's a good point. The, the internet good, was barely a, a thing. That is a good, yeah, point. That is a good point. It's a good point. It's a yeah. good point. But I we still forget think how quick technology is advanced. I would still think that if you ever had an x-ray, which I assume is this guy did, especially because he was having breathing issues, and we can't, we have to remember he's been alive for 36 years, so he's had x-rays in the past. Nobody's like, man, you got an awful lot of bones in your Extra, gut. extra. Yeah, like There's an tumor. extra skull in there. I wouldn't worry about it. I mean... Man, truth not facts, dude. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, look, it Do happened. we know what country this was in? It was oh, I don't know. It didn't. I, it was I don't America, know. America, right? Was it? Was I, think US? So. I think so. I, bl- I blame gluten. It sounds like a, a, a an us thing. It does sound like an us thing. Yeah. I don't know, man. That's that's pretty that's pretty messed up. I told you it was a weird story. That is very weird. Like, uh, do you is, tell your mom? Did I show my mom? No, not you. Does, did he tell his mom? I mean, mom? I sent I'm it sure to her, and she told me it was a nice story. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know what else. It's to... on Fox News or wherever the hell he got this from. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. I just wondered, like, uh, yeah. It was, it was uh, what was that? One News Network, ONN. That's where I got it. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Breitbart. Bright Breitbart. Breitbart. Yeah, yeah. yeah Breitbart. I see, you know, I know so much about him. I don't even know how to call him. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Is it One American? No, it's One American News. It's OAN. Damn oh, it. Man. I wanted to come across as a true uh, Breitbarter. A bright barter, <laughs> a bright barter, but I guess you, I, my, I've shown my feathers. Yeah, it happens to the best of they us. They caught me without clothes. Is that what they say? <laughs> caught me naked. Someone probably is uh, it. Right, here's what, is it bad that I'm not near as bothered by this story as you guys are? I mean, I don't. I mean, I'm. Like, I'm just kind of like, huh? That's kind of cool. Like, I guess nothing shocks me anymore. Maybe I don't know what it is. Maybe I don't know. I've always had kind of like a weak stomach to stuff like this. It makes sense for um, what you do. <laughs> always have i don't know i i just don't i don't want to see it i can deal with it if it's there in front of me like if i saw somebody like going into cardiac arrest or like they got into an accident i know i can i can put pressure on the wound or whatever and i can in the moment it's fine because the adrenaline's rushing but i'm sitting here in my, you don't want to think about it yeah i'm sitting here in my living room i'm enjoying myself got my feet up and i'm <laughs> And then you start bringing about feathers and bones in his belly. Yeah. What's, the, what's the word he used? I don't remember what the word was. The, 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 the homunculus. No, homunculus. The, yeah, the, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I thought you were going for the fetus. No, no, no. The homunculus. Is the one, yeah. yeah. yeah you talking about your fetus fears and stuff? I don't das, know. Das fe- Look, honestly, when he said that, I was I was really afraid this was going to go somewhere way worse. And I don't even know <laughs> where that place was. And when then he, he told brought me, up breeding. Well, when he told me, I was like, ah, that's not so bad. He, he could have been way worse. Issues with his fetus. So. Yeah, no, I feel you. No, no, I just, I don't know, man. I feel like that doctor probably was like, oh, this is. That's nightmare fuel. If I was a doctor, I'm going to have nightmares about that kind of stuff. I don't know. Would you? Yes. Doctors. I'm removing a half formed creature from a man's stomach. Yeah. I'm going to. Doctor's going to dock, dude. Doctor's going to dock. Yeah. Uh, The most of the doctors I've, I've, I've talked to, they're like surgeons and stuff. They're all very they're very, they're very, they're very disassociated from oh, yeah. the patient, right? Like, yeah, it's not, it's, uh, it's barely a human to them. Like to them, is, it's just a job true. to do. Very yeah, it might as well be a dog. They might as well be a vet. Yeah, like I look dog. at spreadsheets. They look inside people, and it's like it's just a thing they do. Yeah, yeah. it's like yeah. when you take your car to a mechanic. That's your baby to them. It's like it's just get this thing out of like, here. Yep. Just, just, just get this thing. Out just here. another fuel pump. I don't yeah. care. Yeah. That's so true. But you have to you have to have that level of uh, disassociation to do that type of work. I would yeah, imagine you do. Especially to look at Excel documents all day. God, Ooh. tell me about it. Yeah. 
<laughs> all right, man. All right. That's all time we have for this episode. Please go to thecrazytown.com and subscribe for Jonas. TNT and <laughs> Mr. X. Uh, we out. That shit.